everyone, I'm Krista, shamanic practitioner as well as teacher of shamanic classes and welcome to my video talking about the healing symbolism of the power animal, also known as spirit animal, the angel fish. Now, if you would like to find out what your power animal is and what it has to teach you specifically, shamans would do power animal retrievals for people. So if you're interested in that, I do offer that as part of the shamanic healing sessions that I do. You can book a shamanic healing session with me on my website, shamanicspirit.ca. I do those sessions online on Zoom. All right, so let's now talk about the healing symbolism of the angelfish. Angelfish are beautiful creatures. They're very graceful. They come in many different colors, different shapes. So when we look at the angelfish, because they have a variety of different colors and they have beautiful wing-like fins, that they are considered symbols of angels. Hence the name angelfish. So if you have a power animal of the angelfish that can symbolize protection from the angels around you. So if you do like to work with angels, it symbolizes having that nice protection and also protection from other spirit guides as well. Protecting you, looking out for you in your life, protecting you from danger, mishaps, disasters, protecting you from people that might not have your best interest at heart. Also having the power animal of the angelfish can also help you to be an angel in human form, to be like a guardian angel, watching out for those that you love, watching out your, for your family, your friends or co-workers, to also offer protection for them, looking after their well-being and their safety of others. And you might find that people will call you their guardian angel. And especially if you are in a caregiver role, looking after kids or family members in that type of caregiving, that having the power animal of the angelfish can also help you with that. That. looking out for other people's health and well-being, taking good care of them, being like their guardian angel. Also people, as they call you their, their guardian angel, you might find that you are in the right place at the right time to offer people help. So having the power animal of the angel fish can open up those types of synchronicities. Maybe you offer a piece of information or advice that is really helpful for someone when they need it. You're at the right place at the right time to offer advice to that person. Or maybe someone needs help on a project or with something they're working on. You're just at the right place at the right time to offer that help. You've got expertise in that area. You're able to offer it. Or maybe you you have a, an object that somebody needs that they can borrow from you and you're there at the right time in the right place and say yes I can actually lend you this object and this can help you so whether it's a book or some other type of object that is useful to someone also when we look at the angelfish some of them have long snouts where they dig into crevices to be able to find you know food and things like this now, when we look at that snout and that uh, digging mechanism, this symbolizes discernment. So having the power animal of the angelfish can help you to have good discernment in what you nose around in. Okay, so for some of you, maybe you have a, a tendency to be a little bit too nosy and sticking your nose in other people's business or problems, okay? If, if that is you, and there's no judgment here, you know, I think sometimes we all do that at some point, that having a angelfish as a power animal can help you to have good discernment. Is it time to step forward and nose around in something, or is it time to step back and let things be? Also having the angelfish as a power animal can also help you to discern situations, to have good discernment over people, to avoid problems and situations that can come back to haunt you. So having good discernment, do I need to stay away from this? Is this going to come back to bite me later? Is it going to come back to haunt me? So the angelfish as a power animal can boost up that level of intuition and discernment to help you avoid those types of situations, okay? And also having the power animal of the angelfish can help keep you out of trouble to avoid those troublesome situations, troublesome people, so that you can rise above that in your life, okay? To create better situations and circumstances for yourself or also if you find that other people hook you into their problems 
hook you into their drama, hook you into their stresses, having the power animal of the angelfish will help to disentangle you from that energy so that you're not getting caught up in other people's stresses or troublesome situations or problems so that it's not affecting you. Okay, so having that nice level of protection, that's another form of protection. Also, when we look at the angelfish, when you watch them swim, they are so beautiful, so gentle, so graceful. So having a power animal of the angelfish can also help bring out your graceful nature, bringing out your beauty and helping you to deal with situations in a graceful manner. So for instance, if someone around you is being angry, irritable, okay, that you're able to deal with the situation in a nice graceful manner when you have that power animal of the angelfish. This helps to bring healing and peace into situations to help resolve issues in a beautiful, graceful manner. Also being able to resolve issues with diplomacy, okay? So having the power animal of the angelfish can really help you to develop that skill. Angel fish, when we watch these type of fish when they swim, it's also slow and graceful. So if you have a tendency to be on the go, you're rushing around, having the power animal of the angel fish can help you slow down, to not rush into things, which can also help you to avoid pitfalls and disaster, to lead you to better success in your life, to lead you to successful outcomes. Okay, so if you're jumping into, let's say, a love relationship too quickly or jumping into a work project too quickly or you have an idea that you haven't thought through completely and you're a little bit impulsive and jumping into it too quickly, slowing down, having good discernment, assessing things in a good way, thinking things through, the power animal of the angelfish can help you with that, which will lead you to a good result, a successful result. And also the angelfish have that nice nurturing energy. So having the power animal of the angelfish can bring out your nurturing nature to com connect more deeply to that side of yourself. And also they're connected very deeply to water. <laughs> Obviously it's a water creature. So for those of you that have a connection and affinity to the ocean, having the power animal of the angelfish can help you connect more deeply to the oceans all of the creatures of the oceans and also the mythological creatures of mermaids, mermen, and merfolk. So if you are into that and you feel a resonance with the oceans, with the merfolk, that having the angelfish is like um, kind of like an ambassador or the go-between to help you connect more deeply to those types of uh, mythological creatures as well, as well as the rest of the creatures in the sea. When we look at water in shamanism, water represents emotions. The angelfish has that nice, graceful energy. They glide through the water so easily. So if you have trouble managing your emotions, having the angelfish as a power animal will help you to regain emotional balance, to be able to move through your emotions with that ease and grace, to process them, and to come out the other side. All right, so I hope you have enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you would like to go deeper into the world of shamanism, I do offer live and interactive online shamanic classes. You can check out my class schedule and register for classes on my website, shamanicspirit.ca. Or if you would like to do a private healing session with me, a shamanic healing session, I do those online on Zoom. You can also book that private shamanic session with me on my website, shamanicspirit.ca. All right, so thank you so much for watching. Lots of love and light and blessings to you, and may you enjoy this beautiful day.